my name is Denise Nichols. Welcome to Motivate Therapy. Today we're going to be talking about the importance of your back and hamstring health. So the back of your legs are called your hamstrings. And the recent phrase that I've heard that I really like is that sitting is a new smoking. So anytime you are standing or sitting for long periods of time, it really puts a lot of stress and strain on the muscles that connect to your pelvis and ultimately your back. So today we're going to be talking about hamstring stretches. Um, an easy one that you can do in the middle of the day or at the end of the day, beginning of the day, really any time, no excuse. Um, you can lay on your back. So again, anybody can do this. And you're going to use some type of a strap. This is a yoga strap. It's nice and long and it's easy to create a loop. Um, you can use a bathrobe tie, a couple belts put together, your husband's old ties, something like that. What we're going to do is we're going to loop the strap on the end of her foot, so the ball of her foot. We don't want it on the arch because that can create problems. And then she is going to use her hands, walking one hand over the other, to stretch. So first she's gonna relax the leg down. I want you to completely relax your body, your shoulders. Nothing should be strained. And we're gonna work it with the breath. So um, the good general rule of thumb is, instead of screaming, blow it out. When in doubt, blow it out. So we're gonna inhale. She's gonna walk one hand over the other. And as she starts to feel the stress or the pain, she's gonna blow it out. She's gonna try to get her the ball of her foot a little bit lower than her heel, so we're getting elongation on the back of the leg and relaxation into the bed. So something called ballistic stretching is safe to do before you're warm. So before she gets out of bed or maybe in the middle of the day, so she's just doing a two second stretch enough to say, ow, I feel that and then relax. Not long enough for the body to tense up. So she's inhaling, exhaling, inhaling down, exhaling, relaxing, inhaling back up. Now, two seconds, five to 10 times before you're warm. Now, after she's gone for a bike ride or a run or something, she can hold for 30 seconds and she's going to focus on inhale elongating, exhaling letting go. So inhaling growing, exhaling releasing. 30 seconds, three to five, or three times for that. Um, again, but only after she's nice and warm and we've got a lot of blood flowing through the body to avoid injury and strain on the joints and tendons. Now, there are actually three heads to the hamstring. So what we just stretched was the middle one. If she takes her strap and, and go ahead and bend your knee, we're going to wrap it to the inside. And what this does is it turns her leg in and I want her to relax her leg all the way down. And that will just naturally turn the leg in. So when she walks one hand up over the other, again, inhaling, exhaling on the top, you'll notice that the leg is turned in and she's gonna feel it on a different spot. Um, notice how she is keeping her knee slightly bent. She is not locking the knee, only enough to feel the stretch. So same concept, she can do either two seconds here, five to 10 times, or 30 seconds, three times, or five to slow, three to five slow deep breaths. Beautiful. And then for the last one, we're gonna turn the foot out, or what's called external rotation. So again, if I wrap the strap to the outside, it's gonna turn the foot to the outside. So she's gonna relax it down, give it a little yank, make sure, tell her leg to relax. Her arms are doing the work here. We don't want the leg to do the work to come up. And then notice how her knee's a little bit more bent here because she's a little bit more tight on this one. So again, she can either hold or move. Also, if you have um, lymphatic buildup, doing the two-second pumping can also help pump the, um, the groin, the lymph, lymph nodes at the groin, so that can be good as well. Then I think it's good to just lay and relax for a minute of slow deep breathing just to allow the body to accommodate before moving on to the other side. Thank you for joining us, and don't forget to stretch your hamstrings. Have a great day.